tonight and the dogs opens at the Lipa Gallery tomorrow. But our very own Jenny Casty went along today for a special preview. So as we all know, Glasgow is a massive city when it comes to art and art collections, all the way back to the likes of Art Nouveau and the Glasgow Boys. But how do you make a subject matter like dog racing into a fine art exhibition? Well, I've come here to the Leaper Gallery to the artist who's done just that. One of my friends uh, was having his stag party at the races in Shawfield and he thought it would uh, be a good idea to get us all together, go down. I had never been, I quickly realised that this is somewhere a bit out of the ordinary. As my friends were putting on bets and, you know, getting a pint, I was busy going round and being fascinated. So talking through that right. space. Okay. That, that's that's kind of like taxi to the race. Yeah, like um, and then you have the queue. Yeah. This is the racing. This is the final. That painting is the final. And then that is the point where the exhibition goes from racing to retirement. So that's why that painting is called Worth One Salt, because he's just retired. And then this is the retirement. So this is all about the rescue. When I was looking at the painting, you start making stories up about their, their, their backgrounds and, oh, they're here because of this, and he's been going here since the 50s, he's been going here since the 70s, and he's, you know, been going here since the last couple of years, so you can actually just see the different generations. What I like about this exhibition, when people think of fine art, they think of a big Kelvin Grove setting, mm -hmm. certainly maybe Art Nouveau or whatever, but the subject matter here is really accessible. How important was that for you to make a subject like a night of the dogs accessible for anyone. A lot of a lot of fine art is contrived. And people are always trying to think what will make the best painting, and what gets lost is the immediacy of real life. And the thing about a night of the dogs for me is this was not a whole team of actors posing in this place for me. It was real Glasgow. It was real Glasgow, but also um, real Glasgow that's a bit hidden. In history, artists have um, used painting as a way of documenting life, but of course we have cameras now, so we don't need to do that. And I think that's a shame because there's nothing more fun than documenting what you see through painting. So the exhibition runs from the 13th of October to the 30th. It's open 12 to 5 and it's uh, 117 West George Street. This place is for you guys. It belongs to Glasgow. Walk in. Now we're back in the kitchen with Jimmy Lee. Jimmy, 